the Create Labs concept is essentially a, a, a natural next step in the evolution of the way we develop laboratories. Uh, in response to the uh, COVID pandemic, obviously uh, we cannot hold labs in the usual way, simply because of uh, people density in the uh, our facilities. And so we have created uh, an approach that allows us to deliver the same learning outcomes in a mixed setting. We also wanted the students to actually be able to do and operate the equipment from a remote situation. And this is something which they will experience in industry, where they will be responsible for operating equipment remotely or directing people in a remote situation, uh, for example, in an offshore rig. So in a way, we are preparing them to become effective chemical engineers and ready for the task force of the industry 4.0, the next industrial revolution, revolution to automate the industrial practices using modern technologies. The HoloLens is basically an augmented reality headset. Essentially, the HoloLens will connect to the Teams call that students will be using to coordinate during the labs. And so using the HoloLens, people who are not in the lab and working remotely, they will have full view of whatever the student wearing the HoloLens is seeing. The main challenge for the remote labs in terms of keeping students engaged is how do you make someone sit in front of a computer and, and stare at a screen for, say, three hours when they aren't really doing the physical tasks involved? The way that we try to get around that is basically um, enrich the, the labs with as much content as possible. And, and not just like in terms of like um, content, in terms of like knowledge, but as well as like task that students can do during the lab. Students are not just going to be like watching their friends do it and the GTA do it in the lab, right? They're, they're going to have to participate as well. One of the major benefits of using HoloLens was the concept of augmented reality guides. They contain a very detailed step-by-step -step instructions uh, for how to operate certain kinds of equipment or to perform certain kinds of tasks. And these tasks and equipment operation, uh, they are not very straightforward. And therefore, embedding some 3D holograms can also give an experience of an immersive reality. So the students can actually visualize how the holograms are in, in, in physical space around them, around the equipment. Um, and they can move things based on those holograms, as well as the instructions that display on their, on their view. We have a range of tools, uh, including uh, HoloLens being one of the major components. Uh, we are using the MS Teams platform, and we are also using uh, QR codes for uh, adding a component of uh, augmented reality. Uh, and we are also using some remote cameras or CCTV cameras. The delivery of the whole process and the designing of the whole process, the testing, uh, we went through a couple rounds of testing for this project and making sure that everything works, all the, all the technology, all the documentation to go with it, everything works, uh, was really the work of a lot of very talented and motivated uh, Europe students, the undergraduate students uh, from the department. The beauty of our Create Lab concept is that we can deal with all situations that we could possibly conceive uh, uh, could happen um, in the in the next uh, couple of months going forward uh, we can accommodate them we can literally run the create labs with no student presence in the laboratory whatsoever and you will still be able to meet the learning outcomes we will be independent essentially uh, of uh, the external circumstances and i think that is 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 a big strength